Well, it's about blooming time we got this car. I've only been waiting a couple of months. So, finally got the car. I had this on pre-order for two months. Let's have a look what I've got. So, this is the new MJX RC Hyper Go C3 WRC Rally Car. This is 1 14th scale. Have a look on the box. Not a lot of information on the box. All you got, pictures of what the actual car looks like. And that's about it. So let's get it unboxed. See what we get. I was going to do some cheaper RCs on the channel. So we got this. So when I pre-ordered this, this was £111. So about $150 delivered to the UK. So let's get it unboxed. See what we get. So controller we get. So we get very, very basic controller. Three channels. Steering obviously. Very, very cheap, basic feel. What else do we get? Set of black drift wheels. If you want to use those. Set of rally tires. Oh, quite hard. A fan. Only one fan though. Toolkit, get a screwdriver, wheel wrench, and your charger for your LiPo. Quite a hefty USB charger, that one. And the main box, let's have a look what we got. User manual, throw that in the bin. Nice sticker sheet. It's nice. And some clear plastic if you want it. Look at that, people. 114 scale C3 rally car. Looks awesome. So look at the car, looks absolutely fantastic. On the controller as well, if you want your kids to play with it, you do have a switch there where you can reduce the power to 70%. That is a great idea. So look at the car, looks absolutely fantastic. So what we'll do, get the old stickers on. So there we go, all the stickers are on the car, looking good. Let's have a look under the body and see what we get. So first of all, look at that, suspension feels really good. So also we get full set of lights, front and rear. So we get, I like this little shield, it's a brilliant idea. Stop all the dirt getting inside your motor and ESC. As I said, suspension, fully adjustable, coil over shocks, front and rear, metal drive shafts, metal CVDs, brush, brush, brushless motor in there. And we also have a gyro in there. So this gyro, you can adjust the gain via that, just turn the little lever, you can adjust the steering gain. Then we have our receiver, and then you obviously you plug your lights into the receiver there as well. Underneath, metal chassis, plastic diffuser and plastic bumper. About earlier, the only fan you get in the package, you can fit it on top of the ESC. So the only thing I'm looking at at the moment, the toe out is, oh, it looks a bit extreme to me, but we'll see how it goes. If it's not that good, we can adjust it up. As I said, there's your gyro. You can adjust the gain on that if you need to. This one also comes with a battery. So currently, this is where I've got it from. So on Banggood, they're currently £118.51p and they're coming from China. I got mine and it was here in about five days. Other specs include, it's got a full metal drive chain, metal diffs, full ball race set as we said fully adjustable coil over suspension 45 amp esc and a brushless 3600 kv motor so battery it comes with is this 2s 2000 milliamp 7.4 volt lion we're going to run this on this battery and we're also going to run it on 3s because this is 3s capable also batteries are in get it powered up little button on the side of the esc Steering, actually not too bad. Power. Flick it across 100. So here we go, body on, powered up. Got front lights, rear lights. Oh no. Why have we got indicators? Gyro work. Oh, goes the right way. At least MJ can get their uh, gyros to go the correct way out of the box. So I have found a couple of 3S packs. Unfortunately, oh, so I have this Overlander one here, but it is it is way too big for the car. As you can see, it's never going to fit in the tray. So we have this, one of my old Turnigy Nanotechs. 
1300 milliamp 3S 50C. And that is there, absolutely perfect. But wrong connector. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna get the connector changed on this one. Right, there we go, connector's changed. We've got the 3S attached. We shall turn it on and see what happens. Maybe we'll try it on 70% first. Oh, no fire, don't let the smoke out. It's 3S time, 70%. Right, here we go, 100%. That's gonna rip, that is, I think. Let's get it out and see what it can do. And remember, everyone, you can win one of these limited edition RC 3D printed jet boats. The game over, limited edition, or one of your choice. Link in the description. So we've got the little uh, Hypergo Citroen. Gonna be a we're going to give it a speed run on 2S and then we're going to give it a run on 3S. There we go. There we go, flat out. Don't let go flat out again. Right, what are we saying then? How fast do you think? 20? Yeah, I'm going to say 25. Yeah, about that. Oh, 25 <laughs> mile an hour. Right, let's get a 3S in it. See how quick it is with that. Right, so we've got 3S in now. Going to give it a speed run, see how quick we go on that. What are we saying this time then, chaps, on 3S? Uh, 30. I reckon 32. I reckon 35. All right. So what did you say again? I, and now I reckon up near 38, 40. Oh, I reckon 45. 41. Oh, oh. We're all wrong. 37 mile an hour. Right, get it on some gravel. So just nip to a new location, we are going to stick it on 2S and see what it's like on gravel and then we're going to stick the 3S back in it and give it another go. So guys, we brought it to a new location where we went before the um, stones were a bit too big and it was getting caught up in the transmission. So we've come down here, got a bit of everything, bit of tarmac over there. We've got some dirt, so we'll go and give it a bash over there and see how we get on. We've got a little bit of dampness as well, so it should be cool. Also, as I mentioned, we're still, we are running it on 3S now. 2S is really good, 3S it's epic. So always run it on threes if you can, it's fantastic. So this is an absolutely fantastic little car for the price, absolutely amazing. Handles really well, speed awesome. Full recommendation for this little car. Obviously not for made for jumping and stuff, but absolutely brilliant. But for your kids and stuff, or grown up, it's absolutely brilliant. Let's go and try on some grass, see how we get on. Yeah. On grass, not too bad. Obviously, it's wet down here today as well, so. The only thing I would say, guys, is just on tarmac, be careful. I mean, I've, I've ruined the tyres already. If you have a look underneath. These tyres that come with it, they're, they're not, you need to get some road tyres. This is not made for road. But I've destroyed the tyres already. Uh -oh.
that's that over and we got it home and oh, I'm well happy. What a fantastic little car this is. For now, check the price today. It's £105 UK money if you buy one today. It's about $140, $150. Um, two batteries, like I said, run it on 2S, run it on 3S. Uh, I have no negatives about this car whatsoever. It didn't put a foot wrong and for the money, absolutely brilliant. Like I said, for you, for your kids, whoever you want to play with it, it's absolutely fantastic. You, have, you can change how fast it goes on the controller. Absolutely brilliant. My only gripe with this car is the tyres. You can see from that, they are now bald. But then again, it's probably my fault. Run it on tarmac, you'll probably get two packs out of it before your tyres are completely down to like no tread whatsoever. So if you do get one of these, these tyres are fantastic. It comes with three sets of tyres, like we said. It comes with these and another set of knobblies for off-road. Get yourself a set of on-road tyres. Gyro works perfect out of the box, unlike some other companies we've tested. Absolutely brilliant. So I'll leave a link in the description for this car. I want to try and do a few more budget cars if I can this year. If you like this sort of video, like and subscribe. It helps me out with the channel massively. Thanks to everyone who watched my previous videos for the jet boats and everything. You've been fantastic. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Have fun everyone and stay safe. Da-da now. Thank <laughs> you.